Hello and welcome back, this is Abigrodos here, and this last play of Tales of Fantasia is brought to you by MuchGames.ca, stupid bag. Anyhow, in last episode we went down to the city below us, which I can't remember what it's called, but it's completely destroyed. And we met... Leah something, which is an NPC. Non-playable character is what that stands for. Funny thing is, uh, they actually used one NPC in uh, Tales of Graces F, but uh, it worked somewhat differently in that game uh, than it will do in this game. Anyhow, we are now at Venezia, which is the world's largest port, according to this old lady. Uh, it's very population driven because many ships go through here. Guess it makes sense. Hello there, kittens. It's a dog, apparently. Only 35 gold for a night's rest! Sweet dreams! Uh, that's a weird transaction. Or transition, I, I should say. Oh well. And we got the waking up music, so let's have a chat. Hey, it's Nancy. Hey, it's you! So, did you talk to him? Well... What's the problem? Let's help her out. We don't have time to be playing matchmaker. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna help out, help Nancy out. I walked up to his father's office a hundred times, but I couldn't get the nerve to open the door and talk to him. I'll go see him, okay? This place is a mess. Me, I work here. <laughs> Maybe that's why it's a mess. Ha! See what I did there? Uh, it, it, it was a poor joke, I know. I'm sorry. Oh well, so we actually want to go and talk to that man's father, which she's in love with. She's not in love with the um, father, but uh, the son of the family. But she's a poor girl, which the son father do not like. Elvin, it was the same. Hello again! Nancy came up here to see you. Nancy is here? She's come all the way. Won't you at least say hello to her? Well, alright. Tell her I'll meet her by the fountain. See you there. So yeah, we have to go back and tell Nancy. Something secret is going on in the Midgard's fortress. I wonder what they're building. Yeah, I wonder that too. Thousand Midgard enemies. I can understand that. A long time ago, the Dwarven used to live in the Moria Gallery, south of Avalonista. Sadly, the wars and the culture are totally extinct now. How is Avalonista's economy doing? Since Midgar has been warring with Laos, we haven't been able to trade here. Well, that's pretty interesting. But I don't believe that... Do you have an appointment? But I don't believe that every... Uh, draw dwarf is uh, extinct. I actually do believe that they are alive, but in scarce numbers. The criteria business is hard work. Uh, oh, okay. What do I know? I haven't worked like it. Maybe it is. Well, if you're making food for an a big group of people, I guess it could be kind of hard. So we got another protector ring. There's actually a bunch of those in this game. Who are you? You can't come in here without permission. Why not? It's an RPG. I can do pretty much whatever I want. It's a hard time for the boss. He's not being able to trade with me, guard. I hope everything works out for Elvin. He's still our top seller. Ah, I see. I hope the war never comes as far as here. Where did Daz come from? I know. <laughs> This is the lounge. The boss's office is over there! Stupid bug, leave me alone! I know I smell bad and you're attracted to shit, but who... Come on now. Yeah, I can make a joke there. Did it work? Did it work? I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm not shit. I'm garbage. Totally different. Nah, I'm, I'm just kidding. I'm alright. I'm a teacher of magic, but I can only teach those with natural abilities. Well, well, screw you! <laughs> All I wanted to use was magic! 
Oh yeah, yeah, we, we kind of want to go tell Nancy about uh, Alvin. She was at the inn, I believe. So, we there we go. Hey Nancy, Alvin will wait for us in front of the fountain. Oh, thank you Mint, I've got to fix my hair. Hurry up and go see him! I'm going, I'm going! <laughs> We're kind of pushing her. How neat. But oh well, without us, Alvin and Nancy will never hook up and have a love baby of their own. So, actually, where do we end up if we go south from here? Uh, we end up down here. Can't really leave the city from there. But we can get to this part of the city. So, let's enter this part first and have a chat with the people here. At the city hall. Uh, let's see. The mayor's house is huge! I'm the only sister! Please stay for the party. They're just throwing trivia question back and forth. <laughs> it's a birthday party. It's a neighbor's wife's brother's former roommate's child's friend's birthday. I'm very confusing. Yeah, you sure are. We were just talking about the wizard of the metal. The myth is a half-elf wizard. He used to research magic here in Venezia. But last year, he changed and moved to a castle on the West Island. I think he's finally lost it. West Island? Perhaps we can catch a boat to the West Island. Let's inquire at the harbor. Uh, we are talking about... When he left Venetia, he looked, well, possessed. Aha! Uh -huh. Kinda like Vane in... Um, our, our own timeline here. Or time... Uh, time lift drift time period that's the word I want to travel daddy says we can't because of the war well that's kind of sad I guess I'm the king of this balcony well I could be so let's have a chat with the mayor don't you know who I am I'm mayor of Venezia where do you come from I'm from South Euclid ah Belladum how quaint do you know Lenius Yes, he's the village elder. Really? Is you actually my twin brother? He left this town ten years ago. If you see him again, tell him hello for me. So yeah, we met uh, the mayor's brother. The mayor. Yeah, figured that one out. Uh, so yeah, the, the, mostly of this episode will be town exploring. So, can I keep that in mind? Uh, I do like to explore towns and whatnot. Do you really think he'll show? Oh, he'll be here. Look, there he is. Yeah, there he is. Hello there, Alvin. Your Nancy? Um, yes? Let's go. They need to be alone. Oh, but it's just getting good. <laughs> uh, um... Nancy, I can't believe I never made an effort to get to know you before. I really think I'm falling in love with you. Oh, that's sweet. What a gorgeous day! A decade ago, this town had many elves living in it. I miss them. Okay. So if we go in and back, will they still be there? Yes, they will. Oh yeah, you were a teacher of magic. I completely forgot about you, to be honest. So let's. Go up and have a chat with the father. Uh, okay, he's not saying anything new. We'll actually come back here later then. I think after we have uh, gone gone to the West, Isle West Island, uh, there will actually be a further progress in this uh, side quest. So yeah, here we have the boat, which will take us to the shops in town. I wish I could learn magic, but I don't have any, a drop of almond blood in me. Ah, uh, sucks to be you, kid. I hear you, kid. I wonder where the elves move to. Perhaps Alfheim. Supermarket! What, who's this black guy? I was supposed to make dinner for my teacher and sister. My father was an elf, so we are learning to use magic from our teacher. My father left us when we were children, but I hope to see him again someday. 
Hey, come on in. Okay, thank you for that game. Mm, let's buy five bread. Uh, we already have ten of those. Uh, let's buy a couple of apples, I guess. A few steaks. Uh, Twinkie. Uh, some seafood. Ah, uh, this should be fine. And we still have the 10,000. Magical spirits used to be common, but nowadays it's rare just to see an elf. I'm a little concerned. Oh, that sucks. You need a royal permission from the Alvanista government to get into the Moria Gallery. What am I gonna cook for dinner? So how do you go get from explaining politics to what am I going to do for dinner? Oh well, the people of this city, they will never cease to surprise me. It's 50 gold to ride a gondola. Hey, where can I take you? Uh, let's head to the weapon shop. We kinda need new weapons. Especially if we're going after a, a wizard and whatnot. That's technically no spoiler because that's what they said in the last episode they were going to do. But yeah, here we have the weapon shop. Only wait, come back when you want to leave. Only way to really access it is by boat. I was sent here from Alvanista. I'm actually from Belladum. There is a bookstore I used to work at with a lot of books at the construction of weapons. Ah, I see. When you fight, you must clear your mind and allow your body to attack naturally. Do you know any elves? Nope. Elves are beautiful creatures, and they can use magic, but they seem to be close-minded to society. Perhaps they really are better than we humans are. Maybe. Uh, sure. Do you know any half elves No. They look like humans, but they have two elongated ears like elves do, and they can use magic too. Ah. Uh, yes we do. Uh, we sure do. Really? Uh, not really. Welcome! Come in! So we have a sharp saber which we already have. We have a warrior sword. Let's buy that. We have a... Actually... 50-50-3 50 6 by you and hello you. I don't think this weapon is as good as the Crossecure. Jamrod, don't mind if I do. Are you sure? Yes. Thanks, come again! So, if we equip, equip these weapons now... Uh, let's equip that. And there we go. And if we go back to the shop and check... Weak, weak, weak. Equal, weak, weak. Okay, good. There's basically no real, no real need for us to buy that weapon then. Uh, where can I take you? You can take me to the armor shop. We want to purchase some armor. So that we have good protection. Let's see... We can actually see part of a house here. Albanista and Miriar used to be allies, but they seems to be splitting apart. Mirgar is forming a large army to deal with us, but Alvanista doesn't seem to be doing much anything lately. Hey, you're a source man. How do you like me to teach you a sword technique? I'll teach you for a reasonable 3000 gold. So yeah, this is how we go we are going to learn most of the skills in the game actually. By uh, paying for them. So yeah, we learn Tempest. Which will increase our attack, I believe. Uh, it was, it disappeared for a while, I believe, and then came back in Tales of the Abyss. It's not in uh, uh, Symphonia, though, so that's why I believe it's disappeared. I don't really have, I haven't really played the games in between this game. All oh, right, I completely forgot about that. It's the dual skills we actually buy for the most part, and I can't believe I did that. We actually came here to buy items, I mean armor. So equal, we have splint mail, which is better. We have a arm helmet. We have iron gloves. Uh, we have a night shield, which we cannot afford. We have a miter, 
You know what? I think it's time to sell some stuff. What do we have? A mixed gummy, which we could sell for 10,000, I guess. Uh, we have hourglass. Elixir. And we have creamy cheese. We have a long sword which we can sell. Um, Ring of Souls meal attacks, but has an. Okay, so we kind of need to save those instead of selling them. Rune bottles are quite worth this. We can sell one, even though we technically need them. Uh, let's see. We have a steak we could sell, I guess. Mystical rune. Okay, we definitely need to equip that on summer later on. We have a talisman for a thousand. We have a blue ribbon, which we cannot equip on anybody. We have a blue talisman, which gives charm bottle. Ah, interesting. Uh, I think that only works for one, though. So, uh, if you're really desperate to with money, I guess you could uh, sell them at a reasonable price. So, I wonder if I... Can I buy both? That's a question. Yeah, I can. Uh, so, let's do that. And we got 58, so we got close to enough to get back over to where we want to go. But I just realized something. We won't be able to afford a boat trip because of it. Which is kinda... Uh, but hey... If we're screwed up like this, then we only have ourselves to blame. Which is sad, but in a way it's... Well, it's what we've done it. So, unfortunately for me, I'm gonna sell another... Actually, let me sell one mixed gummy and one... Uh, uh, one, 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 one... Rune bottle. There we go, we got a decent amount of cash. Which should be enough to take us with both to the West Island, which is our destination. Uh, you can take us to the North End. We're going by boat, we're going by boat. Boating, 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 boat, boat, boating. Oh well. It's always nice to go by boat, I guess. Or gondola. But yeah, there's two ways to the harbor, by the way. One upper side and one lower side. I do believe they take you to different boats. If you got nothing to say, then go away. I'd like to rent a ship, a private charter. Ah, a customer! Sorry, I let your age deceive me. Please take us to the West Island. Ah, the Metals Island. The round trip fare include food and insurance and cost 400 gold per person. That taught us to 1,600 gold. Is that acceptable? Uh, uh, not for now. Come back soon. I'll be waiting here. Welcome aboard. This ship takes private charter request. I went to Midgard, but I had to leave because of the war. Okay, I see. Where are you from? Departure can be scheduled on the deck with the captain. Okay, so let's do that now then. It is quite costly though, but... Hey, at least we can afford it. Uh, yes, we would like to. Let's go! We are going by boat. We cannot get to that island. Not yet, at least. Which is kinda sad. Take care. You come back to the ship. The rest if you need to. Okay, so we have a free inn at the ship. That's nice. Uh, we might need one, and at the same time, we might not. And look at that, we got a mixed gum in there. And question mark book. So, this is a good time to actually show off the rune bottles. Uh, let's see, question mark, question mark, where can I find you? Here we go, question mark book. So yeah, we transformed it into a porno magazine. Better hide this from your parents. Funny thing is, I do believe we can equip it with cloth. 
Yeah. <laughs> it, it lowers our um, power. Our attack power, rather. Yeah. Here we are. Anyhow, this has been Alpagrotus. Thank you for watching. Stay frog, everyone, and I hope to see you next time. See you then.